Hi there, Dave here, how are you? I've been asked by a few people to demonstrate the advantage of a 5 inch hose in comparison to a 4 inch hose. Now a lot of the machines that you have will have 4 inch ports on them and that's fantastic, not a problem at all. But the thing is people run a 4 inch line all the way up to the machine from the dust extractor and if you're going to run a fair distance that can reduce the airflow big time. So my suggestion is with the FM300 that you bypass their Y piece and go straight to a 5 inch flexible hose. If you can get a 5 inch hose from here all the way up to your machine, because of the larger um, volume of air that you can pull through, you're going to have less static pressure reduction. Now I can demonstrate this for you, and it looks like I've got Barry here helping me as well. Go on, go and get it. He says go and get it yourself. Alright, I like him. So I can demonstrate this to you by um, opening both 4 inch ports, which is very close to being the same surface area as one 5 inch port open. And I'll do that because I've just vacuumed inside my garage here and I've sucked up some leaves and some sawdust and they'll swirl around in this bag here in the vortex. So watch what I do. First of all I'm going to leave it with only one 4 inch port open. So here we go, starting up with only one open. Watch the, watch the leaves spin around. If I had one 5 inch hose travelling say 4 or 5 metres up to where I needed to have machines or if I could have some little branches off and go 5 inch down to 4 inch where the machine is, my main line, which is what the 5 inch would be called then, is very efficient in, in uh, the amount of air that it can pull. And of course, which means less blockage and which means more efficient pull from each machine because it's not restricted by a 4 inch hose all the way up to the machine, it's just that last little bit. Okay, tip from Dave, see you later.